Yo, what's up guys, this is Gloves here, and this is Search and Destroy Rushing Tactics on the map Lockdown. And I think it's a pretty streamlined effort, streamlined effort on the attacking side, definitely. Um, it's an odd map for me, Lockdown. I think I get a lot more kills than I do plants on it. Um, if I'm usually going for a plant, I wouldn't go for B. I would normally go to A, and I'd show you the way in a minute. But if you do want to go to B, it's a very similar route. I always rush up here. You have to watch out for snipers sitting up in the window to your right and along the balcony up there because they love to sit up there and just you know watch the routes that they tend to come through through the arch straight ahead and the building that a lot of people are going to be in or coming down the corridor of uncertainty uh, through the middle but I run a rush alongside it and come up come through that way and it seems to bypass a lot of the snipers not necessarily the action but definitely the snipers you can often get a few cheeky kills if you're rushing this way and you go up the stairs behind you where the snipers usually sit and that should be able to clean up most of the kills where I probably head after I get this bomb plant in. Now from the defensive side it's um definitely an easy map to get kills on I think. If you're playing against some noobs it's always easy to get kills so if you're rushing up here they usually like to rush along straight ahead or from behind you here and I have a few clips in public games where I get a couple of kills just sitting there because they like to rush through that building on your left. This way you're left with the option go left or right, uh, left first, um, into this building where Snipers love to sit up in that building to the left. A lot of people seem to like to snipe on this map, and the rushing tactics series sort of tries to combat people sitting up there with snipers. I'm not a sniper myself, but if you can do it, by all means do it. Now, if you want to go right where you were given the option, you have move into this building, and there's the corridor of uncertainty that I was talking about. Uh, people love to sit up there, and I'm sure. A lot of people will get kills if they go this route and then here's a just pick up a couple of cheeky kills sitting in the spot there not too difficult um, I have a lot get a lot of defensive kills drop shot and a lot I would definitely recommend using tactical there if you if you don't already use it you get a lot more drop shots you have to, it takes a while to get used to it but I definitely recommend using it once you get into the swing of things this is a pretty lucky clip here jump inside to side strafing along there not bad um, this is, look how long has gone in the round, it's not long has gone in this round at all and we actually win this round within a minute which is pretty impressive from our team and then just a cheeky kill there and I was going for a plant in A, this is why I don't usually plant at A, there's usually guys sitting around here so if you do just be careful of those two spots, people tend to sit up here and this is sort of a flawless execution of an A plant with a couple of cheeky kills, there's a guy sitting up there take him out, MP5 underrated gun I think it's not the greatest but it's not got a bad fire rate and you should be able to get a few kills if you chuck on a suppressor and this is going to be the end of the video guys so if you like this series please throw a like down uh, comment and subscribe and I will see you in the next one guys peace